While global ocean temperatures are hitting unprecedented highs, one region in the North Atlantic is breaking all the rules. It's home to a strange and unexplained phenomenon known as the Cold Blob, a mysterious patch of unusually cold water that simply shouldn't exist. According to today's most advanced climate models, this anomaly has no place in our current climate. So why is it there, and what does it mean for our future? One curious scientist asked a chilling question, did this cold patch exist the last time Earth experienced similar levels of warming? And if so, what happened next? The answers might lie in one of Earth's most powerful climate systems, the Atlantic Meridional Overturning Circulation, AMOC. This massive ocean current acts like a global conveyor belt, transferring warm water from the tropics toward the northern hemisphere, while dragging cold, deep water back toward the south. It's it's this system that helps stabilize temperatures across continents, making Europe warmer and maintaining balanced rainfall in regions like Africa, Asia, and the Americas. But the emergence of the cold blob could be a warning sign, a signal that the AMOC may be slowing, or worse, heading toward collapse. A shutdown of this system would be catastrophic. A weaker AMOC would shift global weather patterns, causing rainfall to vanish from monsoon-dependent regions, where billions rely on seasonal rains for food and water entire countries could face droughts, agricultural failure, and migration crises. And while Europe might suddenly freeze, other parts of the world could become unbearably hot. Yet despite the risk, there's still scientific debate. Some experts believe the AMOC is already weakening, while others say there's not enough data to confirm a long-term trend. To understand what's truly happening, scientists are digging into Earth's ancient past using paleoclimate records, evidence locked away in glaciers, ocean sediments, and even caves. In places like Greenland, researchers are analyzing ice cores that have trapped pockets of ancient air. By measuring the levels of methane and other gases, scientists can recreate climate events from thousands of years ago. What they've found is startling. During the last ice age, the AMOC collapsed not once, but more than two dozen times. Each collapse triggered massive climate shifts, plunging temperatures by 10 to 20 degrees Fahrenheit in just decades. But what about times when Earth wasn't frozen. Roughly 128,000 years ago, during the last interglacial period, the planet was about as warm as it is today. One researcher discovered that even then, a similar cold blob appeared in the North Atlantic. Using ocean floor sediment, he found evidence that melting ice reduced the salt levels in seawater, weakening the AMOC and causing major cooling in the region. It's a pattern that mirrors what we're seeing now. As Greenland's ice melts, it pours fresh water into the Atlantic, making the ocean less salty and preventing the current from sinking and flowing like it should. If this cycle continues, scientists warn we could hit a tipping point. By the end of this century, under current greenhouse gas emissions, Earth could warm 3 degrees Celsius above pre-industrial levels, far higher than during the last interglacial. At that point, the AMOC may slow dramatically or collapse altogether. This isn't speculation, it's physics. The only uncertainty is how fast it will happen and how much time we have to adapt. The AMOC has shown it can flip quickly in Earth's past. If it does again, the consequences could reshape human civilization. There is still hope. The last interglacial didn't result in total collapse, only a major slowdown. That suggests we might still have a chance to avoid the worst. But that window is closing fast. What we do in the next few decades, how much we reduce emissions and protect the polar ice, could determine the outcome for generations. The cold blob may be more than a mystery. It may be Earth's final warning.